project is sponsored by Altium Designer, which is one of the best PCB design software in the world. By using the software, you can make circuit diagrams very easily. Also, you can design your own professional PCBs. Altium is now included with Altium 365 in one license. With Altium 365, you can share your designs on the web and get feedback to your designs. Visit Octopart.com as a best electronic component site. Octopart gives you the most affordable data by specifications, data sheets, CAD models, etc. Hello, a VU meter, also known as volume unit meter, is a device used to display the audio signal level in decibels in real time. It is commonly found on audio equipment to help users monitor and control audio levels. The analog VU meter typically consists of uh, needle based indicators uh, that move in response to audio signals, audio signals intensity. Uh, this time I will describe how to make such a device that uses a VFT, a VFD vacuum fluorescent display instead of analog instruments. VFD displays uh, are known for their high brightness, high contrast and wide viewing angle, making them suitable for use in a variety of applications. In this particular case, the display is GP1287 with a resolution of 256 by 50 points and it can be obtained at a relatively cheap price. In one of my previous videos, I described how to connect such a display to an ESP32 microcontroller and this time the display is controlled by Arduino. The device is extremely simple to build and contains only a few components. Arduino Nano microcontroller GP1287 VFD display Next 10 kilo ohm pot stereo potentiometer and two capacitors and resistors. The signal from both audio channels, left and right, is brought to the uh, analog inputs of the Arduino through coupling capacitors. As for the code, I don't have much experience, so feel free to modify and improve it. It is basically based on the UHG2 library because only this library has support for this kind of VFD display. Also note that when compiling the code you should use the UHG2 library given below. Uh, in the first few lines of code we can define a values of gain, low sound, high sound as well as the speed at which the arrow returns to, the, to, to its original position. The sensitivity of the VU meter can be controlled with the potentiometer mounted on the back of the device. And now let's see how the device works in real conditions. <laughs> 